Egyptians had made these square pyramids and we saw how the volume of these square pyramids is twice that of this tetrahedron or a triangular pyramid. And now in this film we are going to see how we can join these two pyramids to make a cube. And to do this, you need sticks of different length, 19 and a half centimeter and 14 centimeter and some bicycle wall tube to join the sticks. You can have sticks of other length, but the ratio between the sticks should be root 2 or 1.414, which is the ratio between the side and diagonal of a cube. First take small pieces of wall tube, make a wide hole and weave the other piece of wall tube inside to make a four way joint. Make a lot of such joints. Now, with six larger 19.5 cm sticks, we will make a tetrahedron. This is a pyramid with a triangular base. So first we make a triangle as a base and then connect three sticks on the top to make a tetrahedron. Four triangles, four joints and six sticks. Now with three large sticks, we make a triangular base and then connect the three other smaller sticks on top to make another kind of triangular pyramid. This has the same base as the tetrahedron but it is exactly half the height of a tetrahedron and so its volume is also half that of a tetrahedron. And so now when we make four of these smaller pyramids and join them together we can make a square pyramid whose area will be four times half or twice that of a tetrahedron. Notice the triangles of a square pyramid and tetrahedron have the same area and they are made of the larger sticks. Now we will take four parts of this square pyramid and place them on four triangles of the tetrahedron and amazingly we make a perfect cube. And so interestingly the volume of the cube is three times that of a tetrahedron. Since we made it by joining tetrahedron of volume 1 and a square pyramid of volume 2.